Good afternoon, Colin here with TechOut, and today we're going to be doing an early look at the iOS 18 version of Siri. Now, this isn't enabled by default on iOS 18 Beta 1. I'm not too sure when this is going to come out, if this is something we have to wait for Apple Intelligence for, or if they are going to enable the new UI here in a future beta. Um, but there is a trick where you can get this early. I will link it down below. Um, I did a stream on this where I enabled it um, using this method. Um, and as you can see here, it does work. Uh, so I just invoke Siri there by holding the um, uh, sleep wake button, just as you always would. And you can see the new animation there, as well as the new ring around the screen when you talk. Uh, this also does enable the new um, tap on the home bar to enable Siri if you want to type to Siri. Um, so you just tap where your home bar would be, and you can ask Siri a question just by using your keyboard, like, what is the weather? Um, so you can do that and just hit this button right here. So if you're in a place where you can't really talk to Siri, you can still ask Siri questions and use those kind of features uh, just via the keyboard. Um, now that's something you were able to do in um, iOS 17 and, and previous versions uh, even before that, uh, but you had to enable the uh, transcription, the Siri uh, trans uh, transcription, and when you um, invoke Siri, you would get a text box that would pop up there and you could type to it as well. This enables it so it's just by default, um, just by tapping on the home bar, uh, you can do it that way. And this works if you're in an app, um, it doesn't matter where you are. So you can do a bunch of different stuff. So like even when I tap here, it says set, um, you, know, you can set an alarm. It's got all these pre, you know, suggestions right here. Set dark mode to off. Let's see if it does that. So, yep, it turned dark mode off. That's pretty cool that that actually works. Um, dark mode on. So there's actually a bunch of cool features that you can do. Like if you just want to change a setting without having to go into the settings app or, you know, that kind of stuff, you can just type to it and do it, you know, that way as well. Or, of course, you can obviously t talk to Siri just like before, but... That's what the new UI looks like. Siri acts and sounds the same right now uh, because again, we are not using any of the Apple intelligence features. This is simply just the new Siri UI. Uh, so I just wanted to show you guys, give you a little bit of an early look at that. I am Colin with TechOut. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And as always, have a great day.